I am Dr. Iñaki Leria. I am medical coordinator in Gambo General Hospital in Southern Ethiopia. I can never forget the last meningitis outbreak. All the hospital really was completely collapsed. Meningitis patients. Most of them were children and young girls and young boys. Especially I remember one small baby that arrived really in a critical, critical, very critical way. He was in completely opistotonous, stiffened, so we suspect really meningitis, especially because during the last days all the patients were, were in an outbreak of meningitis. So we performed lumbar punction that completely was purulent fluid. So the diagnosis was clinical, also confirmed by lumbar punction, and we start as soon as possible antibiotic treatment. Little by little, and finally, the small baby recovered completely, and now she's perfect. So really, really, we were very happy because maybe this kid, she could die. And in fact, a lot of people still they still they are dying due to meningitis in Ethiopia and in also in other countries. Especially in southern Ethiopia, in a rural area, like our area, still meningitis immunization and other immunization coverage are very low, are too low, and we are suffering outbreaks. But this is not only outbreaks, the consequences are that due to the low immunization, due to the low coverage, people are dying, are dying due to meningitis, dying to preventable disease. So we can prevent, we can avoid this death. We can avoid that the small babies, young infants dying due to meningitis and also preventable disease. So it's very important to, to improve this awareness creation, to promote immunization campaigns and also to train day by day our health providers in the meningitis, in the suspect of meningitis and the protocol management of meningitis and as soon as we are suspecting meningitis to start as soon as possible antibiotic treatment, IV treatment if possible. So this is going to save lives.